The following is a class on the Sri Mahad Bhagavatam, 6th Canto, 1st Chapter, Text Number 11, given by His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on May 12, 1976, in Honolulu, Hawaii. Uh, the next step, next step means to become culture. Uh, first of all, price chitta. You have done this wrong, you should be punished. Uh, but this punishment will not rectify him. Uh, that is practical. There are so many rules and regular punishments. Uh, uh, in our common cases, they say every day, and the police is giving a ticket to the motor driver, it's still the same thing is going on. <coughs> so, to keep oneself in darkness and make rules and regulations will not help. Just like your government has admitted that they have spent millions of dollars, they could not stop the intoxication habit of religion. That's a fact. But in our Krishna consciousness movement, one who joins, he gives away. That's a fact. What is the defense? The defense is that uh, to stop one kind of karma by karma, we will not help. Uh, therefore it is says, karmana karma niraha. One kind of activity is criminality and one kind of activity just to punish it. This will not stop criminality. This is real. Uh, he uh, must be in knowledge, cultivation of knowledge. He must come to the senses that I am uh, suffering. Every time I commit some criminality, I am punished. This is not very uh, palatable. So why I cannot stop? This this is the beginning of human uh, Unless you come to this knowledge, athāta brahma jīgyāsa. This is called brahma jīgyāsa. So that is possible in the human form of life. A dog cannot. A dog comes within your room and you drive him away to punish him and he stays with some plea he will come. So, therefore, Parikitma, Sukhdev Goswami suggests that we have to make him free from the avidya, ignorance. Uh, that is Krishna consciousness movement. Everyone is uh, under the spell of maya, uh, puna puna, mm-hmm. bhutya bhutya praliyate, it is going on. But we do not inquire that why I am repeatedly accepting the cycle of birth and death. That is all uh, They are rather supporting. Suppose if I become dog, what is wrong? Uh, they say like, what is wrong? Uh, so this means avidya, uh, ignorance. So for eradicating ignorance from life, it requires culture, cultivation. Uh, that is suggested in the next verse. Nasnata pratham evanyam vādhaya avibhāvantihi evan niyamakti rājan sanai chimāya kalpati. That's like if you go to the physician and the physician is giving medicine and he is taking a taking the medicine and a cure, again he is affected with the disease, again going. 
So, why it is happening? It is happening because he does not follow the rules and regulations given by the physician. That what is happening. The physician, as soon as you go to a physician, you have to accept something, do not, and something do. That is called regulative principle. Without regulative principle, you cannot correct yourself. So that regulative principle also cannot stay if you are not a devotee. This is the gradual process. Simply, if I say follow the rules and regulation, it will not stay unless you become a devotee. That is the test of devotional service of Krishna consciousness. Uh, because it is so powerful, devotional service, that as soon as you become a devotee, <coughs> gradually, immediately, all the good qualities of your original position, uh, good qualities means we are part and parcel of God. So God is good, so we are also good. Otherwise, how can we be part and parcel of God? If God is gold, then I am gold. So why I become iron? I am not iron, but I am covered with dirty things. I look like iron. This is the thing. Actually, I am not iron. I am gold because I am part and parcel of God. If God is good, then I am good. So. Because I am covered by the material dirty things, I look like not good. So this is the test. As soon as you become God conscious, your original or good qualities will manifest automatically. The Shasi Bhakti Bhagavati Yakinchana Sarvai Gunai Tatra Samasati Sura Rava Bhakta Sakuto Mahatuguna. Mano Ratina Asatu Dhavata Vali. Then, one who has got unflinching faith, devotion to the law, the Shasti Bhakti Bhagavati Akimchana, without any motive. Then, all the good qualities of God will manifest in Him very soon. Kipram Bhavati Dhanmatma Sasta Chanti Nivatya. Kaunti apadriyāni hi nami bhaktaktanasati avite sudurāchāra bhajati māmananabhā sādhuriva samadhi. These things are there. The devotional service is so nice. If you simply take to devotional service, then all good qualities will come. You don't have to educate him to send some reformatory school or this or that. That will be explained. In devotion service, Krishna consciousness is so nice. If you simply take to Krishna consciousness, that all you are, because originally you are good, you have become bad on account of the material association. Therefore, devotion means to be purified. This is a purificatory process for material contents. Sarvapadhi minin muktam. Tatparakte na nirmalam. If we think the vimarsana, if we think little, so well, that I am thinking I am American or Indian. Am I American or Indian? This is upadhi, designation. By accident or some or other, I have got this body in America, therefore I am American. But next, next time, I may not take the American body. I may take another Chinese body or something else. So one has to understand that I am neither American, neither Chinese, nor Indian, nor white, nor black. Aham Brahma is me. I am fully so part and parcel of That is knowledge. You have to come to that. 
That is Brahma Bhut. Brahma Bhut, a Kusanatma, Nasudati, Nagat, Samasarveshu, who takes you, Madhvakti, or people. So, this Krishna consciousness movement is to purify the daily nature. And so long we are in the darkness of this designation, that I am this, I am that, I am this, I am that, that is ignorance. Suppose a thief, he is thinking, if I do not steal, I cannot exist, I die. So I cannot stop stealing, I must go. So this is ignorance. But if he thinks over, that the cats and dogs and the birds and bees, they are very nicely eating. Eh? They are not stealing anyone's. And whatever he gets by the grace of God, he is happy. This is not. Vimarsam. Vimarsam. Isharasamidam sadbam. Everything God's property. And we are all part and parcel sons of God. So the property is for us. It is not for others. Just like father's property is meant for the sons and government. That's a fact. See, if other sons without any labor, without any endeavor, they can get their food, why I am stealing? This is knowledge. This is knowledge. Why I shall steal? There is enough food. Uh, but because I haven't got this knowledge that God is the proprietor, I am his part and parcel son, so if he has provided food for the elephant who eats at a time, uh, forty kilos, he can eat, and I eat only, say, half a pound, I cannot eat. Uh, this is not. Why shall I stay? Uh, I shall depend on God. Uh, this is not. Uh, so this is Krishna consciousness. I am part and parcel of Krishna. I am God's part and Why shall I start? Uh, there are so many, out of eight million four hundred thousand forms of life, eight million forms of life are less than the human being. Human being only four hundred thousand. Out of that, Civilized men, very few. Out of that, Americans are very few, Indians are very few. Uh, so, if so many, eight million, three hundred thousand pounds of life they can get without stealing, why shall I steal? This is not. Prashtita Bhavansana. As soon as he becomes in quite uh, perfect knowledge, then whole problem solved. So, this is the instruction of Srimad Bhagavatam. If we take seriously, then there is no problem. Otherwise, the problems will go on, and the so called rascal scientists will give us blood that we are making solution of all problems. You see, it is never solved, it will never be and solved in the future also, unless we take to Krishna consciousness. That is a fact. If you like and take it, otherwise, suppose. Thank you very much.